Hello and welcome to Functional Yoga and Mobility for HD, class number four. So today we're going to combine a little bit of our closed hip movement with our open hip movement and develop strength and mobility while we also start to um, focus on our breath technique. So as you start to approach this practice, you may want a chair close by. I'll give variations in a chair. You might want to support one if you need to, or you can always utilize a wall. So if you can, start in the middle of your mat in a position with your feet resting underneath your hips. If you're losing balance in this variation, put your feet wider, as wide as you need them to be for you to feel solid with your feet on the ground. Relax your arms beside you and let your eyes close a moment. And from this position, start to feel how your breath is coming in and how your breath is moving out of your body. And begin to let go of your day, any items of attention, activities you have scheduled later. Let that stuff fall into the back of your mind and allow yourself to focus on your breath and on your body. And if you can, start to make your exhale a little bit slower. And then as you're inhaling, breathe in through your nose. Allow your body to feel like it was getting taller in space and then exhale through the nose or the mouth. Relax your shoulders and let them fall away from your ears. Two more like that. Inhale. Allow the sternum to slightly lift. Allow your body to reach up and then exhale completely. All the air out. Very good. One more time. In. and out. Wonderful. Take breaks anytime you need it. Let your breath guide you on your next inhale. Stretch and reach your arms up over your head. Hold your breath in for a moment and then exhale, float your arms back down. Very good. Again, inhale up. Hold. Exhale down. That's it. We're slowly going to increase the hold after we inhale. Feet grounded. Inhale. Reach your arms up. Stretch up. Hold. Exhale. Arms come back down. Very good. Again, inhale up. Hold. Exhale. Arms back down. Very good. Inhale, arms stretch up, reach up. Hold. Exhale, arms back down. Very good. And then take your shoulders as you inhale, squeeze them up. Go back, exhale, slide them down. Two more like that. Lift, pull, lower. Very good. Again, inhale, lift, pull back, lower them down. That's it. Then reverse the motion. Go back, squeeze them together, elevate, drop forward. Pull back, lift, drop forward. Good. Again, back, up, and forward. Good. And then give little walk, rocks and little wiggles. Okay. Now motion through your side body. You can allow yourself to step a little bit wider if that works for you. When you're ready to inhale, take your right arm, reach it up. I'm going to mirror your motion on your exhale. Let your body stretch and bend over towards the side. Good. Inhale, arm back up. Lift the body. Fill your lungs and pause. And then on your exhale, drag the arm down the leg. Reach up and over. Try to touch the side wall. Inhale, lift up. Exhale to the side. Very good. Inhale up. Exhale, the arm relaxes. 
Take a moment if you need to, to roll that shoulder up. Very good. Switch arms as you inhale, take the left arm, root your feet, stretch up with your fingers. Hold on the exhale, body bends to the side. Let the arm relax on the bottom, stretch up and over the ear. Inhale up. Pause with full lungs. And then exhale, bend and stretch over to the side wall. Good. Inhale up. Hold. And then exhale over to the side wall. Good. On your inhale, rise up. On the exhale, let your arms relax. And take a moment, roll the shoulders a little bit. Very good. Now start to move through your spinal column. So I want you to position yourself, stay in the same position with a little bend in your knees, press your feet down to the floor, bring your hands to the heart. So now our body's gonna move forward and back in space. Hold a little bit after you breathe in. So start by exhaling all the air out. As you're inhaling, pull your arms back, lean your body forward. Hold your breath and then exhale, curl, push into your palms and cross your thumbs, try to pull your arms out in front of you. Again, inhale, allow your heart to travel forward, tilt your tailbone slightly back, maximize your breath and hold. Exhale, round your back, curl, press into palms and shoot. Good, again, inhale. Hold. Exhale. Pause a moment. Two more. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. Pause a moment. You got it. Inhale. Pull forward, stretch and reach your arms, maximize the inhale, hold your breath. Exhale it out, curl, reach and round. Now as you inhale, swing your arms up, big reach. Good, exhale, float your arms back down. Wonderful. Keep your feet about hip distance. Now focus with your eyes, a spot that's not moving. If you need some support, have your chair handy with one hand down. We'll try with one side. We're gonna work on balancing with our hips, heels up. As you inhale, Press into your feet, lift your heels, sweep an arm up. Hold your breath and then exhale it down. Arm and heels synchronize at the same time. Good. Same side again. Inhale, one arm, lift your heels, big reach. Hold at the top, squeeze the muscles up above your kneecaps. Exhale, arm goes down and we relax it. Very good. Again, inhale, reach and stretch. Hold, exhale, arm down, and we relax it. Very good, switch sides. So again, alternate the arms, use your support where you need to, have your feet hip distance or slightly wider on your inhale, lift your heels up, stretch your arm up. Squeeze above your knees, push your feet down, exhale, arm down, heels down. Very good, again, inhale, reach and stretch. Hold, exhale, arms down, heels down. Very good. Inhale, reach and stretch. Hold your breath. Exhale, arms down, heels down. Okay, if you're feeling balanced today and you feel like you can go with both hands, three more. As you inhale, reach up. If you need to, tap the chair with one hand. Inhale. Hold, exhale, bring it down and release. Good, again, inhale, sweep up, reach up. Hold, exhale, lower down and release. Very good, again, inhale, reach up, stretch up. Hold, exhale. Lower down, let your arms relax, step it out a little bit. All right, so now let's get into our hip work. First your closed hip, then your open hip. If you need some support, your chair can be on either side of you. I'm gonna pop my chair over to the side 
so that I have some support with my right arm. So right leg forward, left leg's gonna stay back, heel down. So in this variation, we're working with a warrior one position, two hips facing forward. If you find that you uh, front foot crosses your back leg, step wider. So you wanna play with your step so that you feel that you're not gonna topple side to side. So if you go wider, you're gonna have a wider base of support. So arrange your legs in the way that you feel most stable right leg in front left heel behind heel pressing down to the floor now we'll utilize our left arm when you're ready to inhale bend your front knee press down through your back leg sweep your left arm up if you're comfortable arc good and then exhale straighten and lower the arm very good now we'll add the hold inhale left arm reaches right knee bends you're supporting with the back arm hold Exhale, look down. Very good. Keep going. Inhale, bend. Press into your feet. Reach up and back. Hold. Exhale, the arm down. Very good. Two more on this side. Inhale, deep bend. Reach up. Hold your breath. Exhale, down. Very good. One more time. Inhale. Press into your feet, reach up and out of your waist. Hold with full lungs. Exhale, the arm back down. Wonderful. And then take a step forward in space. Use your chair if you need to, march the legs. Okay, same thing on the other side. So now I have my left palm in the supporting position, left foot forward, right leg back. Do that same thing where you're feeling out your stance so that you have your ability to have your back heel down, you're wide enough for the legs, you don't feel wobbly, and you have one hand resting for support. When you're ready to inhale, bend your front knee, press down through your back leg, and sweep the front arm up and over. And then exhale, bring it down. Okay, now we add the hold. Inhale, slow and steady, press into your feet, reach up. Hold and then exhale it down. Very good, four more on this side. Inhale, bend, hold, exhale it down. Very good, again, inhale, bend, hold, exhale it down. Very good, inhale to bend, reach, hold, exhale it down very good one more time strengthen out your legs strengthen out your nervous system inhale bend press into your feet squeeze the legs and hold exhale the arm down let it relax grip your chair lean the weight forward step it in shake it off a little bit okay then let your breath catch you can roll the shoulders back a few times and let that go Okay, so now we're going to play with opening up the body. So again, if you have some balance issues, you want to have a chair in front of you, have it there. If you want to have it to the side, have it to the side. If you can stand freely, you're going to take your legs nice and wide. If you need to, you can always jet up against the wall. So if you have a wall behind you, you can be resting somewhat towards it. And then legs nice and wide. Good. Now when you're ready to inhale, take one arm. Press down through your feet, reach it up. See if you can look and stretch back. And then exhale that back down. Good. We'll stay with the same side. Five more, adding our hold. Inhale, heavy elbow, press into your legs, rotate your trunk. Hold. Exhale it back down. Very good. Again, inhale up. Rotate, look towards your thumb if it's possible, hold, and then exhale it back down. Very good. Again, inhale, ground the feet, open the arm, turn and twist, hold, exhale back down. Beautiful work. Again, inhale, take your time, slow and smooth breath in, try to rotate your trunk, keep the legs firm, stay. And exhale it back. Very good. 
Last one on this side. Smoothest, deepest breath you can muster up. Inhale. Hold. Exhale. And release. Roll that side off. Take a few breaths. Very nice. Same thing with the other side. Inhale to press into your feet. Heavy with the elbow. Try rotating your trunk and looking back. And then exhale, arm goes back down. Very good. Inhale up. Smoothest breath you can take, hold it. Exhale it back down. You got it. Four more. Inhale, strong legs, open up your chest, look to your thumb and stay. Exhale, bring it down. Very good. Again, inhale. Hold with full lungs. Exhale it back down. Very good. Two more. Keep your breath as your focal point. Ground your feet. Inhale. Look back. Twist back. Hold. Exhale your breath out. Relax your arm. Wonderful. One more time. Inhale. Open. Hold. Exhale, back down. And then give your shoulders a little shrug. Go back, go forward, good. And then you can walk, step or hop, your feet back together, sway a little. Very good, perfect, okay? So now from that little rotation, we're gonna start to play around with opening in the hip joint again. So take your legs wide, press evenly through the outer edges of your feet, this time we're gonna play with turning your right foot away. I'm gonna mirror your motion again, just like a reflection. So if you do need some support, your chair can be slightly behind this leg. Your wall can also be behind you. If you don't need the chair, we'll just keep it there for a moment. Start to play with, as you exhale, bend your front knee. On your inhale, straighten up. And then just start to feel what it's like to bend one side and press the leg down. So doing a little bit of warming before we hold the pose. Down and up. Good. One more. Down and up. Okay. So the next time we're going to hang out there for a moment. So stack your shoulders if you can above the waist. Take a full breath in. On your exhale, take your hip and your knee, bring it down as close to one line as your body allows it. This upper thigh is rotating towards that chair. Hand can be used for support or hand can stretch away. So this is a modified variation. If you have the strength and stability, take your full variation. Very good. Now inhale from here, reach your arms up. Whatever height they can reach, pause. Exhale, point the palms down, take your shoulders off your ears and sink down. Very good. Inhale, lift. Hold your breath. Exhale, arms down, hold, legs nice and strong. Take a breather if you need it. Inhale, hold again. Exhale, arms down. You got it. Two more breaths on this side. Inhale, stretch. Hold, exhale, arms down, spread them. You got it. Inhale, one more. Sink deep and reach, hold. Exhale, arms down, push against the floor, turn your toes, take a breather, relax. So in between postures and rounds, relax. Make any movements you need to to get more comfortable in your body. Okay, and then we're gonna go ahead and switch to our left leg. So again, if you need that support with your chair, I'm gonna slide it to the other side. Stay in the wide leg position. Spit, spin your left foot out, line up anywhere, heel between your heel or heel towards your arch. Check that you're stable. If you need some support, hand can rest here or towards the wall. Now just test out what's going on on this side. Inhale. On the exhale, bend. Back leg strongly rooting to the floor. Inhale up. Exhale, bend. Very good. Inhale up. 
exhale bend and just start to prime up this hip joint to hold this position a couple times in and out just getting used to it feeling your footing on the ground lift and then release now inhale lift hold it there Good. On your exhale, take your hip and your knee. We're going to come into the pose. Try to line it up into one line. It might not get there. Don't force it. Hand can be there for support. If you can, inhale, arms up, one or both. Hold, root into your feet. Exhale, arms down. That's it. Good. One or both. Inhale up. Hold. Exhale down very good three more inhale sink down reach up let your legs root and your trunk lift hold your breath and exhale it down you got it good inhale big reach hold exhale down let it go you got this one more time inhale maximize your breath and hold exhale it down and then inhale straighten the leg exhale point your toes forward that's it very good full breath in and then smooth breath out wonderful again inhale and exhale okay and then heel toe your legs a little bit more narrow you can sway your hips from one side to the other maybe make circles in one direction or the other perfect now down to our forward bending position so i'm going to show this variation with the chair as a support okay this is very helpful to use to maximize the lift in the upper body so take it as your own speed feet can be um, hip or shoulder or wider distance apart i want you to feel stable in your legs now, as you inhale, stretch your arms up overhead. Hold your breath for a moment or two. And then exhale, bend your knees, come down. Tap your hands to the seat. Let your back muscles stretch out. Good. Now, inhale. I want you to lift halfway up. So push against the seat. Try to allow the lower back to your chest to push downwards. Okay, so we're not rounded in the back here. If you need to, bend your knees and stretch your hips back good and then on the exhale fold good inhale reach your arms up with your ears or out to the sides pause at the top and then exhale fold bend your knees release your neck and your head down inhale lengthen your spine out press against the seat try to get your spine long even if the knees are bent and arms locked heart towards a chair good and then on the exhale fold again soften your knees relax good open your arms up to your sides inhale big lift hold exhale fold forward draw the belly button in release the air relax your head inhale press into palms lift halfway good and then exhale fold very good inhale arms wide out to the sides big reach exhale fold okay last one take it down release your neck and your head inhale lift halfway now this time hold it here trying to press your belly and chest forward so no rounding in the back good see if you're comfortable enough to open up your arms reach and hold them and breathe if you need to lower your arms back down Stay for five, very good. Four, three, two, one, lower down. Relax your neck and your head. Hands can be to the seat or your head can rest to the seat and your arms can relax. Either way, take a little break forward. Full breath in, slow and steady breath out. okay very good and then make your way down towards the ground i'm going to keep this chair here for future use come down towards the floor sweep your legs over to the side 
and have the soles your feet down. So you want to have your feet down and then we're going to roll onto the back body. Okay, so take your time, lay down on your back. Perfect. Okay. And then give yourself a moment just to adjust from being standing to the floor. Full breath in through your nose, smooth breath out. Very good. Now on your next inhale, press into your feet, squeeze the back body, lift your hips, stretch your arms up overhead. And then exhale, arms and hips down if you can at the same time. And you don't have to lift the arms. The arms can stay down, but the hips can come up. So inhale, press. Squeeze, option to sweep the arms up. Hold your breath now. And then exhale, arms and hips down. Very good. Again, inhale, lift. Hold. Exhale, arms. And hips down. Very good. Inhale, lift, press. Hold. Exhale, arms down, hips down. Very good. Last one on this side. Inhale, lift. Hold. And then exhale, arms down, hips down. As they come down, bring your knees into your chest. Let the lower back lengthen. Very good. Inhale here, let your knees slightly move away. On the exhale, bring your knees in. Good, again, inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Perfect. And then let your feet come back to the ground, your knees open wide, arms out to your sides, inhale here. On the exhale, let your knees fall towards the left, your neck and head turns to the right. Center on your breath in, to the right on your breath out. Knees fall to the right, head and neck twist to the left. Very good. Again, inhale. Hold it, exhale, drop and twist. Inhale, hold, exhale, contract the abdomen, let the air out slowly, drop and twist. Wonderful. Inhale, exhale. Good. One more time, in, and then out. Good, inhale back to center. Exhale your knees to your chest. Good, inhale a little bit away. Exhale knees to your chest. One more. And then knees in. Good. And then you're welcome to keep your legs down. You're welcome to stretch them out. If you do have a chair handy, you can bring your chair up close towards you. Good. Good. Okay. Perfect. And then. You can allow your feet to sit upright, okay? So this can be on a couch. This could be just flat on the ground, whatever feels better for you and your back muscles. And then inhale here. And then as slow as you can, breathe it out. Inhale, feel your belly rise. 
exhale, contract the lower abdomen, slowly let it go. Wonderful. Let your arms relax. Let your legs relax. Breathe in maximally through your nose. Exhale. Slow it down. Belly falls. Good. A few more like that. In. And out. Inhale. And exhale. And start to let your arms and your legs drop down to the ground. Keep focusing on your breath coming in and slowing it down on the way out. Maximize the inhale, slight pause, and then exhale. Let your belly relax. Good. And then you're welcome to continue this. Staying and resting for the next few minutes. I'm just paying attention to the sensations that you feel. Keeping your awareness on your breath. 